Cut the tension with a knife. No, that's so we have a doctor's appointment this morning. So I think Mondo is officially over. Really good news. All right, we've got a scat throw down here. I've been out. There's Jilly and Ryan. You can cut the tension with a knife. July 4th. High stakes scat. Oh, bad call. The stakes are about to get higher. Oh! <laughs> nice. We have got to take him to Vegas. I know, I know. It's now two to one. <laughs> Nice game. Wow. Wow. Well, good morning, Ryan. Oh, good morning, Katie. Good morning, Dad. Good morning. Good morning, Edward. How are you this morning? The only one who can't talk is how I ask. He's doing just fine. You're so cute, look how cute you are, good boy. Who are you looking at, you looking at Katie? Oh, it's early, well it's not really that early. It's 8.22, we gotta go you guys. We have a doctor's appointment this morning for both our kids. This one is getting her spleen checked. This one is getting his ear checked. Ew, why is your Is there a spleen check machine? No, there's not a spleen check machine. They're just the yes, doctor's there finger. Is. Oh, <laughs> there's a, a spleen check machine? Oh. Cool. Obviously. Okay, you gotta brush your teeth though. I did. You did? She did. Great. Very quickly. All right, we are out. Ryan, your socks don't match. I know. Okay, but actually they kind of do match because one is white and one is black. So they match your shoes okay. and your shorts and your shirt. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. All right, we're out, Mike. All right, good luck. Ryan unplugged the car. It's a new concept for me. Plugging a car in. No, it's different. It's kind of like it's a toy car. I like it. Yes. Alright guys, we are early to the doctor, which is insane. 836. Go Donnelly's. Go be an early. Hey, we Ryan. We haven't done that in a while. No, been early anywhere. Been early anywhere. Yeah. I'm just opening up the third sunroof. Nice. <laughs> I have to tell you, you guys, I don't want this to be like overkill or anything, but I didn't have the opportunity to drive this car across the United States like the boys did, but I've been driving it since we've been home and I'm truly blown away. Yeah. <laughs> like really, I, I I didn't have to say anything at all, but I am saying something because I'm in love with this car. Yeah. We didn't have to use an ounce of gas to get here by the way. Not one. It was all electric. All electric. You know, which is so yeah, cool yeah. for many of you. And I think my favorite thing and you're gonna think this is so boring, Ryan. My favorite thing about this car is the seats, how supportive the seats are. No, that I actually I I saw my favorite thing because there's a lot of cool things about this car. Right. These seats are amazing. Also, the steering wheel can be heated. Yeah. Look. That's kind of ridiculous. Climate. Look, right down. in the middle one, there's he a... Um, heated wheel. Yeah, heated wheel. Bam. Uh, um, and and then, it doesn't leak. That's my favorite part. It doesn't leak. Okay, well, our, our old <laughs> car leaked. We went to the uh, driver... No, what's it called? Um, car wash? It, w it would leak. Well, even when it rained. Yeah. It would leak. So Katie drilled a hole the in the bottom. Roof, yeah, the roof was all like wet from the water. Mm -hmm. It's nice to see a plain colored roof because there were like wet spots. Yeah, we have stains on the roof of our other car. Look at that little sunroof. Cool. All right, Katie, wake you know up. That? Obviously, it's so comfortable that you know she is roof? sleeping. Is that a in my car? Yes, it is. Kate, Kate, oh. Kate. Oh, it's Wake up. Wake up. There's a light. Wake up. We gotta go. Okay. All right, we're gonna get her up. Go okay, in the doctor. I've got this. I've got this. I've got this. Oh, there you go. You can just put her right out. Get up. <laughs> like a dentist office. Yeah, hey, right. Ryan, how's your ear? Let me see. Which ear is it? Oh, uh, this one. Right. Okay. Tell us what your symptoms were. Are. Um, 
my ear hurts constantly, constant pain. Um, I can't open my mouth all the way, can't really bite down hard. Um, if I go really far down in a pool, that's not good. Also, when I was doing freestyle, like last week, I would lift my head up, and a bunch of water would just like stay there. Oh, uh, and do you have the bubbles? Yeah. Yeah, that's my not good. Like popping. By the way, do you know? So you're you're on an airplane, right? Yeah. This might freak you out, but you know how your ears pop when you yes. go really high? Those are actually bubbles. Is that right? That's why they call it popping. I didn't know that. Thanks for telling. Tiny bubbles. In here. Tiny bubbles. No, that's not. Right. In my no. wine. Is that natural? Nice makes me happy. Oh, I thought you were gonna say tiny bubbles. In my makes ear. Makes me feel fine. All right. Well, we're good. It's Don Ho used to sing it, and he is a Hawaiian oh, singer, no. and he would sing it with a ukulele. Comment below if you guys know the song Tiny Bubbles. Katie rolled herself right back into the waiting room. All right, Ryan, you had your temperature taken. How'd it go? I don't know. Did you put the thing under her shoulder? There's Kate. She just went from sleeping in the car to sleeping in the waiting room to sleeping here. Now, I don't know if that's a mono thing or if that's a, she had a big 4th of July thing because she did have a very big 4th of July. Did you have a good 4th of July? No. <laughs> Why? If being honest, so No, it's okay. Uh, I mean, you spend it with dad and I. I mean, is that not fun? Totally. Wow. Hmm? Our 4th of July celebration was really on the 3rd. We went out on the boat yeah, with a bunch of friends. We had a raft July up. Or Saw fireworks on the 3rd. That was really fun. Yesterday, it rained. But we did see fireworks, but not on the boat. We saw awesome fireworks. That was probably the best part. Except for your ear hurt when everybody started beeping. All right, well, we're hoping to get Ryan's ear taken care of and hoping to get Katie's spleen checked. So this is the deal she has mono, as you know. Her spleen has been, her spleen has been um, enlarged. So they're checking it now to see if it's back to normal. If it's back to normal, then she will get the green light to start working out again and living normally. So, and she can dive in the pool for her swim meet on Saturday, those kinds of things. All right, Ryan, they put drops in your, he has swimmer's ear, cotton in his ear. So he, I can't swim, that's a good thing. <laughs> Ryan doesn't want to swim. Well, and I guess he was given permission. Friends. It's not, it's good when I don't have to go swim breakfast. <laughs> All right, you guys. Well, Kate, you can stay there. Ryan, let's go get some breakfast. You want to do that? All right, jump in the back for me. Your seat goes back far enough that you can keep your ear sideways, right? Yeah. Okay, good. Get in there. So, I don't know, we gave you the diagnosis for Ryan, which is swimmer's ear, and for Katie, they felt her, um, what do you call it, her spleen, and it is better. So she has the um, go ahead to go exercise and swim and dive and do whatever she wants to do. So we made it through without her spleen exploding, which is really good news. So I think Mondo is officially over. Does that sound right, Kate? Yay! As is customary with doctors at visits. Yeah. Little Chick-fil-A. Congratulations, Ryan. Katie Kate. Mm -hmm. We have an issue. What's the issue? Well, your mother is about to be turned at her birthday. How old is she gonna be? Hey, her birthday's coming up on Monday. Hey, what are we gonna do? Any thoughts? She wants a suitcase. She wants a, she has a suitcase. She has like five suitcases. I bought her a pan. Is that bad? You did not buy her a pan. She, uh, she, want, she wanted like a uh, plastic. You need to stop so I can type in. Egg um, pan. Have an we egg have pan. a non-stick egg pan. Well, she wanted a smaller one, so we got her one. Happy birthday, here's a pan for your eggs. <laughs> Last year you got her a car, and this year you're getting her a pan. <laughs> wow. Stay tuned on the mom thing, and um, if you have any, comment below <laughs> on what you think we should get. Okay, Still how am I birthday. supposed to? Oh. She said she wanted a plant, too. We will dig up some. Me too. We'll dig up some flowers or something. How Do I do plant? Oh, dig up some flowers? <laughs> How do I search all We're in trouble. It is another day in which to excel. Hey, um, just, uh, it's Saturday morning and we are picking Katie up, waiting for her to come out. Uh, she slipped over a friend's house and uh, we've got a big swim meet today, so. 
I brought Katie a uh, uh, energy drink and her cap and goggles and I'm gonna bring her directly to the pool where we are going to rock and roll and have a competition with the community down the street. So we're looking forward to seeing if we can't beat uh, some very good swimmers from uh, around the corner. So it's gonna be a great day and uh, here we go. I'm just gonna sleep till we get there. You are? Did you say thank you and all that? Of course. Did you have a good time? Yes. Great, great. All right, so there's an energy drink there. This is not an energy drink, this is a naked. Uh, Oh, thank you. You're welcome, man. It's good banners. All right, so back, relax, and enjoy the ride. We're gonna be there in just a few minutes. Here we go. There's Ryan. He has swimmers here, not feeling well. Katie is at the meet. De Brennan is up and around, getting ready to go to the meet. He had his breakfast and everything already. He's down there. And it is early at 7.30, so I gotta go up there. Dad is timing today. That's what he does. Let's get this day started. Oh, let me show you what it looks like out here, you guys. We have our flamingo outside. She needs a little bit of air. Her little head's fallen over a little bit, but it's a glorious morning. Looky there. Dad and I took the boat out yesterday. We had such a nice time. The little flamingo needs to get blown up a little bit more, so we'll do that, and then maybe we'll play on her today. We'll see. It is so nice. Look how calm it is out there in the water. Yay! And the sun is rising for our dead tree. All right. See you guys in a sec. All right, you guys. It is pre-meet. Are you guys ready? What are you looking forward? Huh? Nothing. What are you looking forward to? Uh, going home and tanning Natalie. How about diving? Yeah, we're hanging out. You get all to day. dive in. We're going to meet. And we're going tanning. And then we're going to open gym. Oh my gosh, that sounds like fun. They're getting ready, you guys, for cheer. All right, very good. Good luck today. <laughs> Are you guys there running? I am. Come on, buddy. I have good news you guys, really good news. For those of you who know Cafe Rio, like probably the best Mexican food I've ever eaten. And it's not even authentic Mexican, it's just fresh like Tex-Mex maybe because it's guacamole and tacos and enchiladas and burritos and that kind of stuff. Well. I was introduced to it from my friend Kim because they started in Utah and they opened one up in our area and I became addicted to it and then they closed it, which I was pretty bummed about. So now we can only get Cafe Rio when we go through the Salt Lake Airport or when we go to Utah. But guess what? One just opened up the street. Uh, Fourth of July. So I've already been there once and we're gonna go back there now and have it. It's Cafe Rio. For those of you, again, who want to look that up and see, they have 141 stores, I just said. And this is not sponsored. I'm just saying we talked to the lady, and maybe there's one near you. I would try it. 
100%. So we're going to go there. We had the swim meet earlier today, and then really you didn't see anything in between the swim meet and now because it rained cats and dogs. I did a ton of work, trying to work ahead so I can take a few days off. And um, Ryan went to his friend Nathan's house. Katie went to her friend Natalie's house. And Brennan went to his friend Andrew's house. So Dad and I just went on the boat, and then we had to turn around because the thunderstorm was coming in. So now we're going to Cafe Rio. Ryan has come home from Nathan's, and it's me, Nathan, and Dad. You know where Katie is now? She's at the gym. She went to open gym tonight to practice her tumbling to get ready for cheerleading tryouts, which is very exciting. It's her first time back in the gym since, I'm going to say, if I had to guess, Mike, I would say November, maybe? Wow. I know. And she quit gymnastics in August of last year, but I think she went to open gym a few times after that, but maybe not even November. Like, it could be a lot longer than that. So I told her she's at better stretch out, she take it easy. She took a three hour nap before she went, so her mono is like in check. Um, so stretch out, and she doesn't need to impress anyone. She should just start with the small little tumbling and that kind of thing. So maybe I'm going to pick her up, so maybe we'll get a chance to see her tumbling. I would like to, maybe we'll film it. All right, so there's Daddy-O. Hello. Hello. Ryan, are you ready? Yeah. All right, wanna say hi to everybody? Cause you haven't seen anybody today. You were sleeping when we went to the how you, how's your ear? It's all right. Can we look in it? No. Oh. Ryan has swimmer's ear if you guys didn't see yesterday's vlog. Oh, uh, you might not have seen yesterday's vlog because we never even finished it. We only filmed the doctor, so I'm not sure what we're going to do with that footage. I think we're going to mush it together and have, like, highlights. Highlights? Yeah. 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 And then our, today's vlog. Our Saturday highlights. Yeah. Wait, no, Friday. Friday. Come to the next storm. Oh, okay, we got to go. Storm's coming. Oh, that's exciting. Yay! All right, we're gonna go get in our rental, or not our rental car, our, um, our borrowed car that they still haven't come back to get from us, which is exciting. Should I say that? No, we just wanna thank Chris for specifically. <laughs> for letting, letting us borrow the car. <laughs> exactly, to Cafe Rio. All right guys, we'll see you there, bye. It's very exciting. Thank you, Michael John. Oh, <laughs> uh oh. Bad uh -oh. sign. It's open till 11. Let's go over here. Is it now? I don't know, so I would. Really bummed if just it was closed. closed. That, would, dun, dun, dun. that would be terrible. There we go. You just weren't strong enough. I know. Okay. We know what we want. Okay, Mike wants to jump the line. All right, here we go, guys. Oh, right. it's a little bit dark. Can you guys see? Mm -hmm. We're out here in the dark. We're on the deck. And we're overlooking because we're waiting for the storm. And it's the only covered deck that we have. Oh, was that lightning? Look, at see the wind, you guys? <laughs> so we're eating our Cafe Rio. Can you see mine? I got chicken taco, two chicken tacos, <laughs> quesadilla. Yep. And shrimp tacos with mm -hmm. rice and beans. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. We're here. Katie is at the gym. Brendan is at his friend's house. Where'd you go pick up Katie at the gym? I already told you that. What? Yeah, to pick up Katie at the gym. All right, bye. We're hoping the storm comes in. It'll be exciting. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.